Bjorn Fratangelo, Madison Key's coach and fiancé, looked mortified when he was seen picking his nose during her Wimbledon fourth-round match. ESPN's TV cameras focused on Fratangelo in the court one stands as his other half battled Italy's Jasmine Paulini on Sunday afternoon. And the American, a former tennis player turned teacher, was performing a repulsive deed, much to the dismay of commentator Rennie Stubbs and thousands of viewers who were tuning in. Fratangelo picked his nose with his thumb for about ten seconds, at one point even seeming to flick whatever he could find on the ground. An enraged Stubbs exclaimed, Get the camera off him while he's picking his nose! Fans also flocked to X to criticize Fratangelo for his unclean actions in the audience. One person said, Don't pick your nose in public! especially if your wife is playing in a match and there's a good chance you will be televised, another stated. As Bjorn Fratangelo is flicking his findings and picking his nose, ESPN cameras close in on him. Sir, this is Wimbledon. A third, however, made a joke by quoting a well-known passage from the 1980 film The Elephant Man and asking, Are we not human? How can we not bleed if we pick? I am not a beast exclaimed Bjorn Fratangelo. After losing the opening set and coming back to win a tiebreak in the second, Key's injury ultimately forced him to retire from the match in the third, which was very important. The American, 29, appeared to injure her left leg and had to take a medical timeout before acknowledging she couldn't finish the game. The Wimbledon coverage picked a bad time to focus on Bjorn Fratangelo, the coach and fiancé of Madison Keys. Get the camera off him while he's picking his nose! This is how it appeared on ESPN. With thanks to at Clause 07, screenshot.twitter.com slash atluJHQ303. Before their romance began in 2017, Keys and Fratangelo had met while working out at a facility in Boca Raton, Florida. The couple became engaged after six years, but considering their hectic schedules, a wedding may not be planned quite yet. He really completed it at home, Keys remarked of Fratangelo's suggestion. I was not expecting it at all on the day that I returned from Dubai. He approached me while I was seated on the couch and said, Hey, I have your birthday present. After giving me something, he bent over on one knee. We now have to keep the couch forever because we are just sitting on it. 